This is the real Tom Rose. And this question is a classic SAT made up function. Um, the made up function here is m hash n. And specifically, the operator is the hash sign. What they're intending is anytime you see the hash sign with uh, two values, one on either side, what you're supposed to do is the following ridiculous function. I'm not even going to read it. And then what they ask you is, what is the value of 1 hash 3, that whole quantity, hash 2? Now, I'm going to do this in chunks. So let's start out by just doing, and we'll do this in different colors. Let's do in green, we'll just do 1 hash 3. All right, so, one, so everywhere, notice the 1 is in the place of the M, and the 3 is in the place of the N. And I'm just going to start plugging this in to this ridiculous function. The answer to all of these questions is always the same thing, which is just follow the ridiculous directions and the answer will come out on the other side. And you have to just proceed trusting that that will happen. So let's do this. 1 squared times 3 squared minus 1 squared times 3 minus 1 times 3 squared plus 1 times 3. And the answer to that is the value of 1 hash 3. So this is 9 minus 3 minus 9 plus 3. And actually, some interesting things here. We have 9 minus 9, and we have negative 3 plus 3. That happens to be 0. Oh, that is so lucky. <laughs> so it'll be easy numbers going into the next into the next round of this. Because we've just simplified this. The, the question they're asking you has just been simplified into 0 hash 2. So let's calculate the value of 0 hash 2 over here. And let's do that actually in red. All right. That is going to be 0 squared, 3 squared, sorry, 0 squared, 2 squared, minus 0 squared, 2, minus 0, 2 squared, plus 0, Two. These are all multiplies, by the way, in case that's not clear. And the value of this will be equal to 0 hash 2. And let's go ahead and solve this. This will be 0, 0, 0, and 0. And happy day, the answer is 0. Check the answer choices. And bing, we do have a match. It is B. That was very lucky. Again, simply follow the crazy instructions and trust that the answer will pop out the other side. And we were very fortunate there were some um, easy numbers in this one. So it was not too, too long.